All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, sorry about the live feed. It cut out at the last minute. It's just my luck. <laughs> so, <clears throat> where I left off, though, when I was watching back on the other video, Wim Hof is just a crazy mofo. And... He has done so much for so many people in this world with creating happy, strong, and healthy individuals that it's insane. He, uh, he even just had another baby after having four children. And with his recent partner, he has now fathered a brand new baby boy. And he is 70, I believe. So if that doesn't say anything about his method, then I don't know what will, guys. But he is a man. He's definitely lived life to the fullest, being this alpha male, masculine male, just going out into the world and going out into it and going out full force, going into the world and doing everything that he could to live his life to the fullest, to live out his purpose. And he lived it in such an extreme way that people just could not believe that his method was actually working. So, yeah, and I don't usually film at this time, but when I woke up this morning, I had some kind of inflammation in like my right nostril and kind of on my face a little bit. It still hurts. So I, uh, I've been trying to figure out what's going on, so... But uh, I will put on a mask tonight. I use uh, a poultice that I made called Comfrey Root. And you make a Comfrey Root paste with uh, organic honey and wheat germ oil, which is high in vitamin E. And then you mix in the powder, which is um, a formula from Dr. Christopher. You just mix equal parts of it. Make up as much as you want or need or with what you have and then you just stir it together and then you can apply it to inside area like the inside area of your nose and then where your face is feeling the swelling and it hurts you can just press it against that and just put like a uh, piece of gauze over it so anyway i'm gonna try and i usually wear that at night and i'll stuff some of it up my nose if i have this kind of weird inflammation. Um, I've had this on and off. I have actually got a broken nose from, or wasn't technically broken, but it definitely is messed up and busted from training. Uh, I used to train in fighting, so did boxing, MMA, part-time. Uh, didn't really get too good, but I learned a few things, so anyway. And I wanted to try and wrap up my live video with uh, the story of Logan. So, there's going to be no spoilers in this, and I'm going to try and keep it short. But, you know, like I was talking about earlier, you know, being an alpha male or living as a masculine man is living your, deep, your deepest purse, your purpose. Or you're, li you're living your deepest purpose. <clears throat> living your deepest purpose. That is the point of being a man and being in masculinity and having that masculine energy. David Data talks deeply about this in the book, The Way of the Superior Man. I cannot recommend that enough for guys to read if they really want to know the differences between masculine and feminine energy. They are real. They do affect one another. They polarize each other. And they're complete opposites, but they attract. There's a reason why we have these energies. There's a reason why... Men and women have masculine and feminine energies. And so, it's like in the last part of the story of Logan, in the movie, at the end, he finally realizes that he has to do this. He finally realizes that he comes to his realization that he has to be a hero. He has to be a hero, and he has to save him. And what we see is that in that purpose, in the masculinity energy, man's mission, man's purpose is 
to live and die in a day of living out your deepest purpose. You know, if you could if you could live every day as if it was your last, how would you live it? You know, would you live it doing your your purpose? Would you live it doing the thing that you love the most, that you are passionate about the most? And that's the key in masculinity is living your deepest purpose and constantly getting that question through your head, you know, what is your deepest purpose and discovering it. It's kind of like finding out your why and a lot of times your why changes, but there's a sweet spot in there is that with men with a lot of drive and with a lot of commitment to what they want to do in life, they will seek it out. They will find a way, they will fix the problem, they will stay curious and they will try and find out how to live their dreams. And that's the story of Logan in a nutshell. You know, masculinity, masculinity, living and dying in a day. Living the deepest purpose. So with any masculine male, that's what you'll see. You'll see that in real life. You'll see that too with certain kinds of guys that are very um, energetic, very active, willing to work those 80 hours a week, like Jordan Peterson talks about and such. So with that, Sign alright guys. This will be the last video for a while. I'm not leaving YouTube. I will be back. And who knows, maybe I will have a video up my sleeve or two in the next month. I don't know. But stay tuned. Love you guys. Thank you for all the support. Appreciate it. So other than that, have a good night.